thing. Even if I am, I won't yield. We don't want you to yield through force of arms. That wouldn't be a victory for us. Yeah, our goal is the same as yours, Sir Balls and Branya's. We just want to preserve this world. There's Japard, brother. Surely now you can see the need for pragmatism. Even if you don't believe my outsider friends, you should believe me. Maybe I've wasted your trust. In which case, believe Bronya. Lady Bronya. <sighs> There's nothing more to say, Jepard. The decision is yours. As a captain of the Silver Mane Guards, I am duty bound to carry out the orders of the Supreme Guardian. But, Lady Bronya is the commanding officer for the front lines. According to military protocol, if the front line directives of the commanding officer clash with those of the architects behind the lines, a soldier must remain at their post and await further directives. <laughs> For the Silvermane Guards, the Guardian's orders are paramount and absolute. But there is something of equal... The people of Belabog. If we lose the people, we lose the reason for our existence. Our fight with the Fragmentum Monsters is for the sake of preservation. But our fight- If you are truly able to prevent our endlessly unfolding misfortunes, then the people of Bellabog are indebted to you. But if you are using lies to mask your true intentions, using my sister and Branya for your own ends, I swear by Klepoth that I will carry out- You're not lying, I promise you. You must be Zila. You are a skilled fighter. Your combat style is nothing like that of the guards. Regardless of what you believe, these guys have been a great help to the underworld. Many people would vouch for them. Hmm. If you want to advance further northward, you must traverse an area entirely corroded by the Fragmentum. It's the only way to get to the Snow Plains on the other side. The guards can give you some time before the next wave of attacks is upon us. <laughs>